Thank you for having me. My name is Dele Adeinka, the Chief Digital Officer at Polaris Bank. I'm the Divisional Head in charge of Retail, Digital and Transaction Banking in Polaris Bank. Very well. Welcome, Mr. Dele Adeinka. How does it feel to be carting away the award for the Digital Bank of the Year and as well as the Best Bank for MSMEs of the Year Award for Polaris Bank? Thank you very much. It's exciting for us and I think I'd like to start by appreciating the organizers. Business Day confesses for making this possible for the bank. The award in itself, the two awards, we're dedicating it to our major stakeholders, our board management, and the customers who made this possible for us. And of course, our very dedicated set of staff who have worked over the years to make us recognized for this award and also for ultimately getting awarded with these two beautiful awards. By the way, this is the fourth year we're getting this to set our awards in the rough and we are very grateful for being counted worthy, having gone through all the appraisal period and finally getting awarded this beautiful award. Thank getting you. it for the fourth time in a year says a lot about what you are doing. I mean, if you're doing something consistently and you're getting award, the award you've gotten in the past years, is it also the award for the Digital Bank of the Year? Correct, or? correct. So what do you think you're doing differently in the banking so, sector? So I just think the bank, Polaris Bank, is dedicated to one, using technology to fight out there to compete in the marketplace. We pride ourselves to be a leading digital bank in the industry. To serve these customers, we really know that the best we can do is to use technology to compete out there. There are several other indices with which we can compete, but as a bank and being a retail bank for that matter, we decided to use technology to fight. Uh, and that is ascribed to the awards we are getting, both from the digital point of view and even for the MSMEs, MSMEs. that we are also serving. So whether they are retail customers, whether they are corporate customers, and whether they are SME customers, we are out there to serve them. And we are diligently doing that uh, in the market. So how has Polaris Bank been able to navigate, especially in this time where it seems like the banks are sort of, you know, sort of like a tussle between banks and the fintechs. fintechs. Yeah. What is Polaris doing to stay relevant? Okay, so the name of the game is not really to compete. The name of the game is for us to collaborate. So we're collaborating with the fintechs rather than competing with the fintechs. And we made a lot of our offerings available to the fintechs. We have a very strong, formidable sandbox today where we have wow. made all our APIs available. And the fintechs are seeing us as the best bride and as a group partner to collaborate with, to serve their own customers by extension. And both our customers and their customers are getting the best of two worlds. So all of what banks and the deposit money banks are offering today, as well as fintechs, we are collaboratively offering that to our joint customers. Our, uh, and our customers are getting the best um, for this. So what do you want to tell your customers who obviously uh, they are a huge part of your success? Of course, it's to appreciate our customers who have over the years stayed with the bank despite all the different changes and to also congratulate them for making this possible because without our customer, we wouldn't have been able to achieve all of this. So we are grateful for the customers and we're encouraging them to stay glued with the bank. They've been benefiting and will continue to give our super best in serving them and ultimately delivering the best return to our different shareholders and stakeholders. Thank you very much, Mr. Delia. and enjoy me. the rest of your evening. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you.